People are stealing my packages off my front porch and I'm sick of it. So we're gonna use artificial intelligence, an AI $20 camera, and we're going to prevent any more stolen packages. I'm gonna 3D print a large woman's hand and that hand is going to offer either a reward to the Amazon employee or it's going to offer something else. We're gonna decide what that is. I've thought about many different things. 3D printing a hand is not easy, especially something that articulates. I think the most difficult thing about this project is designing artificial intelligence that determines whether or not it's an Amazon employee, it's a porch pirate, or it's a family member. That negative event needs to happen and not hurt anyone. My intention here is intimidation. I understand that this shirt is a little tight on me right now, but the fact of the matter is the ring camera doesn't do anything. It doesn't run a particular event if something happens. It's just a notification. No one, they're used to a ring camera now. They just wear a mask. They know that there's not good resolution in the camera. So I said, okay, how can we figure out based on if it is an employee to leave them alone? And then if it is not an Amazon employee, what to do? So I said, okay, I'm not giving these hardworking Amazon employees enough rewards every Amazon person wants to be acknowledged. What I did is went on SenseCraft's website, developed an AI classification model, where I put in three different classifications and I uploaded a bunch of images per classification. The first one was bona fide official delivery driver. I went ahead and uploaded a bunch of pictures of Amazon employees with their boxes. The next thing was family or friend. I grabbed some of these images from my ring camera but I had to dress up like a family member like myself. I just walked up and I put that image up into that classification model. Unfortunately, I had to get into another tight outfit and I had to look like a porch pirate. That uploaded into the porch pirate classification class. Now that I have those three classification classes, I can develop my AI model and beginning training it. Once I train the model, I deployed it. Now that I'm able to distinguish between the three different types of people on my porch, a pet is coming in 2025, I want to develop either a reward or a penalty for coming and delivering something on my pet porch or trying to steal it or it's something that's indifferent. So what I did was run two different experiments. The first experiment for the reward, I thought of a variety of different things and I had people rate them based on what they thought. But when it came to the actual penalty, what was going to be the intimidation factor, I ran a separate experiment and that's when things got dangerous. The things that I tried were really not appropriate that were honestly at risk. And even though that people, you think that people are trying to violate your home, as soon as they come on my porch, they're on my private property and I am liable. So some of the things that I chose to run in that experiment were actually not really worth the risk of a stolen package. However, I was able to find something that really worked out well. Some things were inappropriate, but then I was able to distinguish this was the most intimidating thing that I could have done. So now that it's all working, it's just a matter of whether or not people used it or not. It turned out that the problem was most people were confused, even though that I spent an absorbent amount of time on the 3D printed hand, wearing tight costumes in order to do this experiment. Also, partaking in some of the rewards, which really wasn't healthy for my tight costumes, it didn't work out as well because I failed in making the cooler big enough. So even though that I think that my stolen package content is down now, I have less stolen packages than I did before, the amount of money that I, I accrued during this project wasn't really beneficial to this cause of stealing the package. So the question now is, what do I do with this highly technical artificial intelligence cooler? I'm not sure, I'm thinking about other ideas.